going on, guys? A little bit of a Christmas mail week, I guess you could say. Uh, might only be a couple pieces coming in this week, but I'll show them all as they come in one big video again. So let me just work the camera a little bit this way. All right. This was all part of a mixer I was in. Um, most of it will probably be eBay stuff. Maybe something into the store. I'm not too sure. Terrence Mann, Silver Rookie. Uh, Donovan Mitchell looks like a cracked ice. Almost thought it was numbered there. Donovan Mitchell. Uh, this is how that new classics. Kyle Hamilton, Silver. Favre and... Oh, it's Favre Double Transitions. This was pretty cool. Herbert, uh, 99. A lot of numbered stuff in this. This will probably go in the store here. Dotson. Um, select Draft Picks Auto. Sam Howe Rookie. And Dotson Silver. So nothing crazy out of the break. It was cheap. Um, had the Commanders and... Commanders? I remember what it was. Um, Chargers. Packers. And uh, Ravens. And then I, these were the basketball teams with them. I took four teams trying to chase something uh, different for a change. But nothing crazy, nothing crazy. All right, guys, we'll see what else Mel is coming in. Stay tuned as this continues going on. All right, guys, continuing on with the Mel week. I had a couple packages to pick up today. And then the rest of the stuff should be in, if I don't get it before Christmas, it'll be in right afterwards. So we'll have a massive video on the whatnot stuff coming up. All right, so this here is one whatnot auction win. And then I got into a buddy's break trying to, I'm going to, oh, I do have the light on over top of me. Uh, trying to catch the Steelers and Kenny Pickett stuff. Didn't hit the Steelers, hit some other teams. But I'll show you what I got. Tua out of 50. From Absolute. This is all going to be eBay stuff in this hand. Waddle. Waddle, waddle. This is thick for being a silver. I'm not too sure why they're so thick of a card. Stargazing out of 100. Jamar Chase. I think this card's selling like 4 or 5 bucks. So like I said, it's an eBay card. Out of 199. Flipper Anderson. If I had to collect somebody, it might just be Flipper Anderson. If that's just not the best first name. Flipper. I wonder if he gets uh, had like people go in high school and college and whatever else, middle school, go, just like making dolphin noises or not. All right, moving on. Aaron Donald, uh, two ninety nine. Like I said, that's just some eBay stuff because I've been throwing cheap stuff on eBay, like under hundred dollar stuff. Uh, unless it's graded, then it goes. You know, I don't worry. It goes to PSA type deal to look looked at. Uh, Christian Watson, buy the storm out of a hundred. Surprising, this is a $25 card. Last sale, $26, I should say. I reached, started my computer, there we go, earlier. Pretty cool, that'll go in the, on the website. I'm gonna replace some cards on there today. Uh, Tyler Boyd, tools of the trade out, 99. So, Jersey, Jersey, football. Bengals people. I don't know. I thought, I'm guessing probably $10 to $15 card. This was my win. I got it for $11 plus $4 shipping. You guys will see this card again during my whatnot cash out video or whatever I'm going to call it. Ritter. Out of 50 from certified. Last sale when I got this was $60. I haven't looked after last week's game. But pretty cool little piece there. Something easy. Um, small to move. It seems the shows I've been going to. The smaller stuff seems to sell more than the bigger stuff. And when you start thinking people coming around when 20, 30% off, it's a little bit easier to work down on smaller cards than it is the big cards, even though I know they all add up over time. Other than that, guys, stay tuned. We got more packages in, uh, be coming in throughout the week. And this video will continue right now. Well, continuing on, we got another day of mail. Uh, only one card came in the mail today, but I want to keep up with the video footage. So this here was purchased off of Whatnot. I got it from Sappy Sports Cards. I've known Sappy for a few years now. He was doing a high-end night, I believe, when I did this. It was Whatnot's high-end night. This card went for $65 plus $4 shipping. Amari Cooper Cracked Ice Rookie Ticket. And this is the uh, um, 
I, I, it's something right. I can't remember what LKNG means, but it's it's like one of the modifications. But Cracked Ice out of 23. I value this around 300-ish. Sappy even said the same thing on his live stream when I looked it up. It might be a little bit more because a two-year later one sold for like 250 260 So it, it's, it, it's definitely a $300 card. But really happy to pick this up. It'll be something I'll move down the road. Look to, you know, use the profits into something else uh, for the collection. But pretty cool to pick that up on Whatnot. Still the deal. Still the deal. You guys will see that video when I do the uh, Whatnot video once I get the rest of the cards in. But other than that, guys, keep watching. We're getting ready to go to the next day. Should be a couple more things coming in, and then we'll close out this mail week before Christmas. Continued on. This is the last segment of the mail week. We had three packages come in, so two are from Whatnot, and then that'll almost complete the series. Uh, that video will be out next week. Uh, hopefully, this other guy mails out the package. He said it would show out Wednesday, and here we are Saturday, and all it shows is printed label. We'll talk about that in another video. So first one, this is from Whatnot. This is from Black and Gold. Uh, really quick shipping. Uh, nice shipping and all that stuff. Surprising the volume they do. It went out the next day. I, I was impressed by that. Now I know if you go on there. Some people say this guy's a little bit annoying. He hypes stuff up. But I picked something up. Uh, I never have a whole lot of basketball for my display. That's more like a lower end stuff. So I picked this up. This is the select uh, fast break disco version. John ja Morant. Not numbered or anything. But it is courtside. If the camera will work with me here. There we go. Maybe. Might just be the one touch. The funny thing is they ship all their stuff in one touches, guys, unless it's graded. So you always get a free one touch with them. But this is going for around, I, thought, I think it was 55-ish when I looked at it offhand. And I had to look because I thought these were all marks on. It's actually part of the uh, stadium background. So... Something, like I said, I, I don't have a whole lot of basketball ever for the shows, so this will help out with it. Got into a hockey break with AJ's Hockey. Just trying to hit some of the big rookies. Don't worry, I struck out. So, uh, out of 205 from Game Use, Kyle Burrows. Got a cool-looking uh, manufactured patch here. Uh, not even going to try it, but Denisenko. I won't even get the first name. Artifacts, Kupari, rookie out of 499. Kachuk. Yeah, that's how you say it. Uh, $9.99. Some base cards. But did get a uh, Young Guns pack for all the teams. I know there's another pack still, or another package still out there. It probably won't show up till next week. Uh, finally, M -Pol or Polo 58. Sorry, everybody calls them M Polo. It's Polo 58 or whatnot. Guy does a lot of high end, starts stuff at a dollar. Uh, I will say this: if he's watching this or anybody knows him's watching this, let him know. This had to be by far the best packaging I've ever seen come to me in ten plus years. No lie. This came. I wish I would have saved it. He had it cardboarded up. Stuff was team bagged. It was a uh, rubber band like you would send a PSA. Then it had bubble wrap wrapped around it with painter's tape. He had the, the cards all with, with the label that you have to print out for whatnot wrapped into that. It, it, it was really nice. Let me tell you that. Inside a bubble envelope, all that. I mean, it was. I was impressed by the packaging. And you do, will not hear me ever say that that much on somebody's packaging. Very, very impressed by it. Good job. So, picked up uh, three cards from him uh, the other night. Again, he's out of uh, Ohio, I believe it's Cleveland. Ship next day. He does mass volume, too, when he's on. So, kudos for the quick shipping and everything from him and Black and Gold. AJ's breaks very quick, too, with the mouth that they break. So, I want to make sure I give everybody their props, too, and very quick shipping on all these. So, first up, the Contenders Playoff ticket. This is Cole Anthony. If I can get the show, there we go. Out of 99. I may grade it, I may not. I don't know on this. Just one of those things that's up in the air. These are hard grades to begin with, with the foil onto it and stuff. So we'll see. Plus, he's not really selling for a whole lot out there. 
But I figured, you know, it was cheap. Could be, you know, down the road he explodes and now it's a, you know, two, three hundred dollar card. He was a hyped up rookie last year, too. Kate Cunningham, always a fan of this Cork uh, King's first steps. I, I like it because it reminds me of the sneakers from No War that I loved years ago when the products were a lot cheaper. Hint, hint there, uh, Panini. But I picked this up. I think it was like eight or nine bucks. It's a, it's a little over a $20 card onto it. And I, I figured when I bought uh, three cards, you know, you start getting a cheaper ship and it's well worth it offhand. I'm not going to grade this. Core Kings, of course, a little bit harder to grade. Because you usually get some type of whiting on the corners out there. Try not to sneeze. Finally, in Origins. Kenny Pickett rookie. Went to battle for this. Paid at comps for it, but you guys know I'm starting to add Kenny Pickett to the old collection. Okay, camera. It's so cold, that guys. I'm telling you. Outside. There we go. And I even ha I had to turn the heater off in here. My basement, because it's being down below, it's just it's even colder. Because it monitors the heat upstairs, of course. Not numbered or anything. It may go get graded eventually. I don't know on this. I didn't really look it over. Just Hey, Kenny Pickett, you know. Uh, that, like I said, this concludes the mail week this week. A lot of it was from Whatnot, minus one package. It's still out there. It said it was going to be shipped. Never has gone out yet. Sent the guy messages. And now I'm starting to notice as I look at his profile, his days just keep adding up for how long it takes in the ship. So I'll give it through next week, and then I'm going to have to go through Whatnot on to it. Unfortunately, you do have bad experiences like that. But, you know, I, I can say for this much, black and gold, very quick ship next day, the amount of volume they did. AJ's brakes is always good if they're shipping with the amount of their brakes. Usually within two days it ships out. And then Polo 58, very, very quick as well onto it. Very happy with the deals, guys. I will have a whatnot video coming out uh, next week. It'll go through some where I'm winning the cards. I think I even have a shot of me losing a card and going, dang it. Um... Just something different. But next week, we're going to go live one day. I have a said budget. <laughs> it'll be fun because I'll be, I think it's the day after my surgery. I have it scheduled to start. See how long I can stay on till I can hit that threshold. But it's a good thing to pick stuff up from there. I know a lot of people don't like whatnot and stuff like that out there. But I'm telling you, if I could pick cards up at 50% of what they're selling for an eBay, it's just... It's it's foolproof. Even though I could pick them up, sell them, they might drop between now and then. At least they're worth comps, you know. But other than that, guys, I'm out. May you guys have a Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays out there to everybody, you and your families. I know it's Christmas Eve day. Ho, 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 ho. That deserves a like. And I never asked for a like. All right, guys, I'm out. Have a good one. Stay safe out there. Stay warm if you're out in the cold. I'm out.